Thank you so much. Mga kalaluwigan sa Nueva Ecija, to all our viewers, at sa lahat po ng sumusubaybay sa MPBL, it was our honor and pleasure now to introduce to you at kapiling po natin ngayon ang ama ng Nueva Ecija, Honorable Governor Oye Machas Umali! Message for um, our governor. Magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. At the outset, let me congratulate both teams, where we see a rice vanguard for winning the North Tournament and also equally yung ating pong mga bisita from Sambuanga. Let us make this event exciting, interesting, and injury-free. Wala po sana na magkaroon po ng uh, masaktan. Sa pagitan po ng dalawang kumpunan nito, siyempre ako po ay tingan may baysiya, kaya hindi ko tayo nakakampi. Pagdating sa larong basketball, lahat ay magkakasama. Isang pahayag na bawat Pilipino mahilig sa basketball. Huwag na natin patagalin. Let the games begin. To God, always the glory. Maraming maraming salamat, Governor Oye Machas Umali, Governor of Nueva Ecija. Baka Nueva Ecija, anda na ba kayo? Isang sigaw lang, bago ko po ibigay sa ring announcer, sa ring na announcer, eto'y lagi natin ginagawa, Nueva Ecija! Nueva Ecija! This is Game 1, the Finals! Both teams still have time to warm up before tip-off. This is Game 1, the Finals! Ayan na, yung akin. Ayan, naririnig ko na, naririnig ko na. Okay. They line up early. Seeds in the house. Why not?
That loss made us stronger. It toughened us. Uh, I just told the players before we leave the dugout to remember the pain. The pain of game one. So we don't want to experience it tonight. We're going to go all out. Never ako nagka-doubt sa team na to. I know that they will deliver in the end. Jabs kick out. Cyrus Tabi. Big one. That's a big time three point shot for Cyrus Tabi. Door tayo ito. Hindi kami bibitaw. Kasi wala nang bukas eh. Pag natalo kami, next season na naman. Ayun, kaya binuos talaga namin lahat ng best namin para manalo ngayon. ngayon. JC, drive. Oh, what a basket. The biggest basket of the night for the All Star game. I know. JC Marcelino. Now the running. No counter steal. Akaloni misses. But Mike and Rico is there. Byron again. Bombs away. It's on. Bounce pass. Good pass. Inside. Will Makaloni to Shaq Naganas. Coach Jerson Kavitis will now have that golden opportunity to win his first regular season title. The Nevi Sea Rice Vaggers are your 2022 MBBL North Division Champions. From 22 teams, only two remain. Nueva Ecija and Zamboanga were tested in the previous round, but still emerged as the best from the north and south. These two well-coached quads with talented and experienced players will battle for the MPBL title. This is Game 1 of your Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League National Finals. They lined up early, looking to get the best seats in the arena, and uh, why not? It is the most important game of the season so far. The Neves here, Rice Vanguards, uh, almost unstoppable throughout the season, uh, aiming to bring home the biggest prize of all against the Sambuanga team that has responded to the challenge every time they've been pushed to the wall. The Kings of the North and the Rulers of the South begin their battle for the season's ultimate prize. It's game one of the MPBL National Finals. Zamboanga against Nueva Ecija right here at uh, in Palayan City, Nueva Ecija. Magandang gabi mga kaligas. Sila ang tupas kasama si Coach JV Gayoso. Of course, Nika Abisamis is at courtside. And Coach JV, you feel the anticipation, you feel the pressure, and I know you've been through this. Yes. What usually goes on sa mga utak at mga, you know, well, very simple, no? How the, the, the mindset is prepared for a game like this. I'm pretty sure you know, Sedev, that the very, uh, the very first step to any journey is the most important step. And for these two teams, tonight is their very most, the, the most important step 
that they will take to get closer to winning the championship. Yeah, definitely something to look out for. Game one po ng ating MPBL Finals. Mapapanood sa One Sports Plus and of course our Facebook page and our YouTube channel mamaya on 1PH la, delayed telecast ng ating game one. No, tingnan natin muna. No, bago tayo pumunta sa serious business, tingnan muna natin ang ating mga MPBL shoutouts. Siyempre, kailangan natin marinig ang ating mga fans and MPBL shoutouts. Here we go. Galing kay uh, Maricel Santaygilio Manuzon. God bless you team. Nueva Ecija Rice Vanguards. We're not only asking for good luck but for the blessing from our dear Lord to give us this national championship. Hashtag Rise Above Vanguards. Para naman Galing naman kay Dante Tubat. Good luck sa dalawang team. South versus North. Zamboanga versus Nueva Ecija. Proud Zamboanga Families Brand. Sardines ako. Win or lose. Team ZFAM. Saludo ako. Galing naman kay Nelson Tobe. Good luck to both teams in the national finals. Go MPBL. Ang liga ng bawat Pilipino. My heart. Heart. Galing pa kay <laughs> sa ating uh, mga supporters dito. And Coach JV. Siyempre, no, matitignan nyo yung uh, social media natin. Masusundan nyo po ang uh, MPBL on Facebook, the Marlika Pilipinas Basketball page, and of course, your official MPBL on Instagram. Hashtag MPBL Playoffs 2022, our story for this finals. It's been, it's been a grueling season, but we're down to our last two teams, and it's a battle between the Defiant and the Dominant. Now, Defiant Zamboanga has defied all adversity they have faced all season. And ang mga uh, Nueva Ecija naman, naman, they've been dominant all throughout this season. Oh, oh dominant kasi napaka tindi talaga ng lineup nila, and you can you can see uh, it is there's a higher percentage of Nueva Ecija winning their games because of who they have in their team. As for Sambuanga, everything became unpredictable dun sa Southern Division kasi medyo equally matched up ang mga players. Well, Sambuanga facing tough odds against this Nueva Ecija team. But pag-usapan natin ang road to the finals ng ating uh, Zamboanga uh, family brand sardines because they it wasn't easy, Coach JV. Although they finished the regular season with an 18-3 and record, puro pahirap ng pahirap nung last two rounds ng playoffs ang hinarap nila. Well, matindi talaga nga ang, mga, ang matchups dun sa Southern Division. Everybody really played well. Over Bacolod, very tough game. Uh, even Batangas, medyo nauna pa nga ang pagpanalo ng Batangas but they took the Cajos and they really controlled that game. Three wins for them got them here to the finals. Well, for Nueva Ecija, uh, unstoppable as we mentioned during the regular season but nung uh, North Division Finals, they suffered their first defeat. A 25-game uh, winning streak coming to an end against San Juan but bumawi sila and they got the job done and uh, they are here right now in the national finals. Nakabawi talaga itong ano, Nueva Ecija Vanguards but you know the scary part there is nakatikim sila ng talo and that loss will hurt because they know they're a strong team and they're not supposed to lose. They will carry that over for sure dito sa finals game against the Sambuanga team. Well, these two teams faced each other only once ng ating uh, regular season and it was uh, Nueva Ecija coming out on top of that matchup and ang maganda dito is that you know marami nang nangyari for both teams and I think you know it, it's they've, they've come at different points now sa kanilang kampanya with regards to pagharap nila from that time definitely the first time they actually played together changes everything once they come into a finals game like this the matchup the preparation the the, 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 the improvement of each team the, the cohesiveness of each player playing with each other changes and that's the reason why matinding preparation talaga nangangailangan but in their previous game highly dominant ang Nueva Ecija makikita mo 50% shooting compared to 36 for Sambuanga 3 pole field goes 40 to 20% favoring Nueva Ecija again turnovers 23 turnovers 17 for Sambuanga makita natin 19 to 21 favoring Sambuanga on the points uh, Ben scoring 35 for Sambuanga 27 for Nueva Ecija but like I said August 8 pa yan December na tayo. Ibang-iba na ang mga teams na lalaro sa gabing ito. You know, the, you know medyo dikit din yan, no? Itong game na to, na medyo sa, hul, sa dulo, humabol yung Sambuanga. And it right. became a really tight game before Nueva Ecija came out on top. Let's go to Mika Bisamis, who is with our commissioner, uh, Kenneth Doremdes.
Maraming salamat. And before we start the festivities, I am with our good commissioner, of course, Commissioner Kenneth Doremdes. Come, first of all, I'm so happy to be with you inside this jam-packed Nueva Ecija Coliseum. Ang saya-saya po ng mga fans na nandito ngayon, ano? Pero bago po yan, Com, ikwento nyo naman po sa amin kung anong nangyari dyan sa uh, PSA na press con kasama po ang mga kaibigan natin doon. Well, uh, unang-una, uh, magandang gabi, uh, Pilipinas. Magandang gabi, Nueva Ecija. Magandang gabi sa mga taga-sambuanggang nanonood ngayon. Well, nagkaroon po tayo ng press conference last Tuesday doon sa Philippine Sports Writers Association uh, tungkol dito sa national finals natin. So, represented by both teams, coaches and players. And uh, nandun yung mga uh, sports writers natin na sumusuporta sa MPBL. And tinignan nila, nagtanong kung sino ba talaga ang magiging champion natin for 2022. MPBL National Champion. And Com, uh, speaking of the National Finals, take us through your thoughts, Com. Uh, gano kayo ka excited for the series? It must be one of the most exciting finals in the MPBL. Of course, ko excited tayo, mas uh, excited yung mga fans natin nandito ngayon and sa mga kanya-kanyang kabahayan nanunod. But definitely, Nueva Ecija has the talent. But of course, Sambuanga has the heart. No, sila yung team na never say die dito. So, sa mga fans po, supportan po natin and uh, sigurado mag-enjoy po tayo sa series na ito. Thank you. Maraming salamat once again, our good commissioner, Commissioner Kenneth Doremdes. Now, I turn you over to Richard Tampos for the start of this ball game. Your evening has never been this way. Sino manguna sa harapan ng mga kampiyon? This is the OK Bet. Manny Pacquiao is the MPBL fourth season, game one of the best of five national finals presented by Extreme. Live at MPBL FP page, signal play, and one sports plus. JC Marcelino. Tough pass. Oh, ho, ho, ho. what an adieu from JC Marcelino onto his twin brother JV. Bautista for three. That's good. Sobrang saya kasi yung pinagpakuran namin sa tagal ng pinagpakuran namin. At least paano may, may napatunayan kami pero hindi pa rin yung ta tapos yung laban. May national finals pa. Jab, skip out. Cyrus Tabi, big one. That's a big time three-point shot for Cyrus Tabi. And Zamboanga might have just survived already on their home court. What a ball game. That's it for Zamboanga. Here are the starters beginning with the MPBL South Division Champions, Zamboanga. Family Brand Sardines. Starting at center number 23, Chris Dumapig. At forward number 14, Decoy Lopez. Also at forward number 17, Jabs the Samurai Bautista. And from the guard line, the Marcelino Turbo Twins, JB Marcelino and JC Marcelino. Zamboanga Fabulous Brand Sardines is led by Vic Icashano. Sa bawat larong na ipapanalo, may masaya, may nagdududa. Sadyang malakas lang daw itong Team Nueva, kaya mahirap mag-iba. Pero ang hindi nakikita ng iba ay ang aming sakripisyo, ang araw-araw na ensayo. Ang maghahanta ng magdamagan sa makakalaban. Tinitiis ang malayo sa pamilya. Para mabigyan ng magandang laban ang mga naniniwala sa Nueva Ecija. Sa bawat saya ng panalo at lungkot ng pagkatalo, nariyan kayo dahil sa inyo kami.
Kayo'y nandito Sa haba ng ating nilakbay Malapit na tayo sa tagumpay Ilang laban na lang Ang kampiyonato ay mapapa sa ating kamay Ngayon pa ba tayo susuko? Ito na ang tamang panahon is Jerson Cabiltes. Referees for this ball game are Donald Belnas, Rodel Brida, and Jay Castroverde. Fourth man is Alan Manzano. This game is under the supervision and regulation of the games and a miss bar. Our starting lineups for Sambuanga, it's JC and JV Marcelino in the backcourt. Kasama nila si Japs Bautista, Decoy Lopez, and Chris Domapic. For Nueva Ecea, they start out with Jesse Gabo, Michael Wico. Byron Villarreal, Jay Collado, and Michael Mabulak, the man in the middle. Our officiating crew, Jojo Bernas, Sudel Brilla, and uh, Jay Castroverde. Our fourth man is Alan Manzano. We are underway. It's game one of the MPBL National Finals. Nueva Ecea and Zamboanga, Villarreal. Takes the first shot of the ball game and he will miss. I'm still shocked. Jay Collado out jump and won the tap. You see a lot of weird things in the finals, but look at that high in the sky play. JC and JV Marcelino, that's a play ran throughout the season and they opened the scoring two to nothing. And I guess that two man game of theirs started way back, right before they were both born. Fast break here for Zamboanga. Bautista drops it off to uh, JV Marcelino. Four to nothing and a quick start here for Zamboanga. Quick start indeed. You know, ito talaga kailangan sa dev ng, ng uh, Zamboanga team. They cannot get Nueva Ecija to set up their defense or else it's going to be tough for them and probably rely on outside shooting. Marcelino. Here's Decoy Lopez. Back at Chris Domapig ang bola. Domapig with 10 on the shot clock. Great D there by Collado. They force the turnover. Villarias finds Mabulak inside. Michael Mabulak. That rims out. JC Marcelino. Gets it up to JV. JV on the move. Put back. Chris Domapig, six to nothing, Zambonga. It seems right now the defense is when the Marcelino brothers penetrate. Big men are going to help to try to cover the path to the basket. That time, leaving Domapig free for the second chance opportunity. Now two minutes gone by in the first quarter. 
Nevaecia still looking for their first basket. Take a look at this move from uh, JV Marcelino going baseline. Kitang kita kalyado, tumulong, biglang na libre. Ito si Dumapig for the putback. Villarreal. Nice D again. JC Marcelino. Here's JC. Goes to Jobs Bautista. Couldn't handle the pass. They will recycle the offense. Here's Japs. Looking for Dumapig underneath. And uh, Bagsak si Mabulak and Dumapig turn over Sambuanga. Well, Dumapig actually pushed Michael Mabulak back. No, got him locked up, but Mabulak just fell and took away the, his legs. Yeah, pulled the chair right there. Villarreal. Good closeout by Decoy Lopez. Taken away by Villarreal. Three on one break. Mabula. And we are pretty much going to hear that response from the crowd with every nearby Sia basket. Oh, my. That's why I'm not going to hear it because it's ng cheers sa mga tao. But here we see top defense on JC Marcelino. Even yung steals sa kanya earlier ni Kay Villarias, he was asking for a foul. And uh, titinan natin nangyari dito. Oh, nice trip there by Villarias. A clean swipe, obviously, right there. And uh, Michael Mabula scoring underneath. You know, I wanted to mention at the top of our uh, broadcast, no, sasabihin ko sana, very imperative talaga na manalo ang Sambuanga sa Game 1 because if they lose, they will need to beat Nueva Ecija back-to-back -back, and that's a tough thing to do, Sadel, with the lineup that, Sambuang, that Nueva Ecija has. Very experienced players who can actually, you know, go berserk anytime, any given time. So it's, it's a must talaga, Sambuanga takes this first game. Now you would want them to get at least a split right. uh, re and this uh, swing ng uh, Nueva Ecija dito sa series. The delay of game warning on... He's been replaced. Not sure what happened there. He had something under his shirt that uh, referees had him remove, but that's... A, that, that's that's actually problematic for the coach because you have a certain time to bring a player in. Great steal by uh, Jay Collado. Uh, Jay Collado, a few hours away from his uh, birthday, scoring his uh, first basket of the ball game off that steal. Kita mo yung takbo niya, alam mo, point guard, ano, ang bilis. Well, Jay Collado, I think, parang point guard din kasi yung laro nito dati. Before he, uh, Really focused on, uh, you know, playing that uh, four position. Marcelino short on the three. Gabo grabs the rebound. Quickly to Wico. Michael Wico is fouled. He'll get two free throws. I like Michael Wico. His attitude talaga, pag nakatanggap ng bola, atake lang. No hesitation whatsoever. So here we see a tandem arm. Being pulled down by Michael Wico and the steal by Jay Collado. No, it looks like there was plenty of contact there, Coach JV. Ang dami talaga, pero medyo tago. Nakatago siya. He had his back turned to the referees. Kaya hindi nakita ng referees sa likod niya. Yun ang mga experience na kilos na nangyayari. Sabi nga eh, pag there's no foul in basketball, pag hindi nakita ng referee. And that... Punta muna tayo kay Mika Abisano. Coach Vic Ekashano said, we are going to stay together. It will be a level playing field. He knows this crowd will try to get to his team, so he made sure they got the right training to tune them out. Now, in terms of offense, alam naman daw natin na he does not have a legitimate shooter, so the boys were instructed that anybody can shoot for the series. Now, for defense, which he believes is the only thing that would give them a chance against this Nueva Ecija powerhouse, he made new plays and even named them after DC superheroes. They're Superman, Wonder Woman. So we will hear the boys shouting these things once in a while on the court. Pero ang abangan daw natin sa court mamaya, si Batman. Lalabas daw siya dito. Wow. Sidel, Coach JV. 
Oh, thank you, Mika. That's a nice report from Mika Bisamis, you know, just some uh, really nice nuggets of information. So, ano kaya ang favorite ng play ni Coach? Uh, it looks like Batman is his favorite superhero, kasi nga Batman yung pinaka special as we bring you this uh, free throw brought to you by Extreme Appliances, ang subok at kompletong appliance brand ng Pilipinas. Well, bagay na bagay talaga mga superhero ang kanyang pinili kasi kasama natin sa courtside, Wonder Woman eh. Kita mo naman. Tama ka dyan, but... Ha habang tayong dalawa dito, pareho tayong gummy bears. <laughs> gummy bears? <laughs> oh, gummy bears. Pareho tayo. Huwag ka na... Huwag ka I na cannot umisip. help but agree, but look at that move. That was quick. Off the defensive rebound and four points now for Michael Mabula. We are tied at six apiece. Well, this is the storm that Samwaga knew would come. All they need to do is just ride it out. JV, Bautista all day to shoot. Short. Wiko quickly to Gabo. Gabo lays it in. Has it Gabo? Downshift. Biglang kuma rumangka. Rumachada ng todo todo. It's a quick eight to nothing response from the Rice Vanguards. Villarias to Mabula. And credit Hesed Gabo for pushing the pace. And here he is leading the break. Six to nothing down earlier. And now up eight to six. Halfway through this first period, we have a timeout from Zamboanga. Matchup, uh, Michael Wico of Nueva Ecea and uh, JC Marcelino. Alos uh, magkakapareho lang ang stats uh, oh. sa field goal shooting and uh, rebounds. Pero lamang si JC in assists and um, points. And I'm pretty sure yes. yung oras sa paglalaro, mas lamang na lamang si JC Marcelino. He often finishes games. But uh, not to discredit anything from Michael Wico because this guy starts everything out and he's the energizer bunny. Di para dito sa team niya, etong Nueva Ecea. You know, if I were a coach pre uh, preparing against a player like Michael Wigo, um, I would hate that job. You cannot really actually prepare something to defend Michael Wigo because he's just so unpredictable. He, he runs, shoots, he slashes, he, he goes around, picks, curls. I'm, I'm for you know, what the problem with Michael Wico as well is that may mga energy plays siya, you know? right. when, when it gets the crowd going, you know, may, uh, may kasamang intangibles yung mga shoot lang siya, may kasama pang, uh, uh, you know, intensity na usually hindi natin makikita sa normal na player, ha? Tama. At may konting asar pa sa kalaban. Marcelino, that's uh, JV Marcelino. Here's uh, Hesed Gabo. Four minutes, 40 remaining here in the first. He swings it over to Jay Colliado. Short on the three. Pinasok na si Jay Mo Igilos for Zamboanga. JC Marcelino. Igilos wants it underneath. I want to talk a bit about the big men of both teams, you know. We, we ang dami nagsasabi dito sa Nueva Ecija. Maraming big men who really can, you know, put a lot of pressure against the big men of Zamboanga. But many probably don't know, tatlong big men ng Zamboanga have outplayed all the big men dito sa Nueva Ecija because once upon a time, they won the championship as, as Batangas players way back when. I think our first, first league. Yeah, that was the first season. Yes. Adi Santos, Jemo Igilos, no stranger to this uh, level and the pressure that comes 
uh, playing uh, in a championship game. JV Marcelino Santos travel. I was hoping Adi Santos would take that shot. Lopez coming back in for Adi Santos. A lot of trust given by Coach Vic Casano on uh, Decoy Lopez. Didn't actually start the season with Zamboanga. Five turnovers for Zamboanga already. Tatlo naman for Nueva Ecija. As said, Gabo. Goes to Wiko. Oh, what a block. Two players going after that shot of uh, Toto Valerias. But Zamboanga has not scored in the last four minutes. Philippe Eagles are like a little out of pass, but here we see that great block by Marcelino. JC, I believe. Uh, JV. JV, JV Marcelino. Villarreal. That's a familiar sight for the Nueva I see a faithful. Doan toa sila pag nagigita nila si Villarreal na ka score. From beyond the arc, Asairo Stabi responds with that layup. Well, in that, that opportunity of Villarias, medyo naka dumaya kasi si JV Marcelino. Sumising it siya sa dalawang tao who were actually the obstacle to defending Villarias. Still here for Zamboanga, JC Marcelino. Aguilos wants it. JC waves him off. JC on the crossover. The layup. Wow. Four points for JC Marcelino. What about that move, Coach JV? Una, pinaalis niya si Jemo Aguilos, who had actually locked up his man. Pinaalis niya, he penetrated, leaned to his left, and just made that tough shot. Mabulak against Lopez. Spins and scores. Six points for Mike Mabulak. Well, the key, really, for Michael Mabulang is staying out of foul trouble. Totoo yun. Uh, he's foul prone because nga, he has the unenviable task of guarding uh, big men who just post up. Lopez score, uh, misses on the three. Bagsak si Mabulak. And a foul on Decoy Lopez. Uh, two former JRU heavy bombers going at it. Kitang-kita, hinawakan sa Bewang at hinatak niya itong si Michael Mabula. I bring you this epic move of the game in partnership with OK Bet. Own the win. Crossover. And the left-handed scoop inside. Very tough. Way, tough to defend for a big man, Mike Mabula. But great game for him. Shaq Taganas comes into the ball game. Crowd favorite, Shaq Taganas. Saved Nueva Ecija season with that legendary Game 2 performance against San Juan in the North Division Finals. Oiloan had that ball snapped away at this last touch on Oiloan, though. Nasak na Irvin Palencia and uh, Jeff Komia. Palencia against Manalang. Komia. Now with Palencia. Holding foul. Looks like it will go against Manalang. Kahit bago maglaro, nakikita ko itong dalawang koponan talagang nagahawakan sila. Must be good friends once upon a time. But tonight... Pa parang tayo dati. Yun! Na good friends <laughs> Yun! Still... But Palencia, on the Palencia's pass rather, here's Manala. Taganas, 10 seconds, the shot clock, my never is here. Palma, goes to Macaloni, baseline jumper will drop. Will Macaloni, his first two, with a bounce. 10 to 15, Palencia to Comia. Goes to Iguilos inside. Jamo banks it in and one. That's where he's reliable. So every time Jamo Iguilo asks for that ball, you need to give it to the guy. Nice two man game here, Komia and Iguilos. That's a breakdown there. 
Medyo malayo si Macaloni. Malayo. Pero help, help defense lang si Macaloni. Shaq Taganas was the one actually who tried to you know, prevent the pass from being made to Jemo Aguilos. 15 to 12 is our score here. This guy, Jemo Aguilas, can be a big factor in this game. If he can actually score 10 to 15 points in the paint, lakim bagay yung for his team because that's added firepower and may give the big men of us, uh, Nuevo Ecija a problem. 15 to 12, they get another opportunity. Wanga unable to make their free throws here. Egilos trying to make his move. Shot clock down to two. And that will do it. Sa shot clock ng uh, Zamboanga. And nobody there directing na kailangan nilang itira. Kailangan nilang itira. But that was something that, you know, I did not expect him to do from the top to try to penetrate against his man. Palma, Macaloni, here's Manala, down low to Shaq Taganas, finds Oiloan, back to Taganas, left-handed layup, wala, rebound Palencia, and he is off to the races, Irvin Palencia, binigay kay Comia, easy basket. Great unselfish play by Palencia, attracting everybody, thinking that he'd go for the layup, and he just dishes off to Comia. Manala. Goes to Palma. Palma off balance shot. Great D there by Zamboanga. And they will go for the last shot of the quarter. Looks like Lopez is hurt. Well, Lopez stood his ground as Palma was making his move. Medyo natamaan ata sa at nadugo yung kanyang kilay sa kaliwa. Gets replaced by uh, Jason Grimaldo. Another veteran player of the finals. Yeah, also with championship experience with some with uh, Batangas in the first season. So a chance for Zamboanga to take the lead at the end of the first period. Unbelievable. Just as we said, with championship experience. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Probably unaware. Kasi Nasa ma- finals na tayo. <laughs> Oo nga, but pag nakikita mo kasi yung painted area, may orange at blue, isip na siguro, yung blue, yung blue part of the painted area, kasi yung makikita niyo sa screen niyo, yung, yung, yung ano, Makikita niya yung orange and blue, but he's played here before, I believe, and he would probably know that. Ayan, no? Kala niya siguro yung dilaw, hindi kasama sa binibilangan 3 seconds. So, we'll... Uh, wala pa sa penalty ang uh, Zamboanga. Seconds remaining. Macaloni drives. Blocked by Grimaldo. Yung tira ni... Uh, Renz Palma. And that's what Grimaldo does best, just play in- intimidating defense, blocks every opportunity of their opponents. Doon, masasabi natin, let's give it to him, nakabawi siya. Second remaining here. Villarreal's tough shot. No. And then nagtatapos ang ating uh, first quarter of game one of the MPBL National Finals. Yeah, but I see a rice vanguards against the visiting Zamboanga family span sardines. Zamboanga got off to a quick six to nothing start. Pero bumawi unti unti ang Nervaisia uh, responding with an eight to nothing run of their own. And uh, as we finish this first period, yeah. Nervaisia with a one point lead at the end of one. Alam mo sa Dove, nakakatuwang uh, makita na both teams had 50% made in their possessions. Uh, 7 of 15. Napakaganda. Very uh, adequate for this first quarter.
uh, battling it out for the national title. And it, ito yung uh, kanilang mga uh, output nung uh, regular season. You know, first, ang uh, Nueva and uh, points per game, pangatlo naman ang Zamboanga. Pang, pangatlo, and even even the, the, the points uh, allowed, medyo nandun sa taas yung dalawang teams na to, and that's the reason why they're both here. And a big lock right there. Cyrus Tabi thought he had a free lane, but Ogloan says no. Grimaldo gets the inbound from Comia. Comia wants to clear out two-man game with Grimaldo. Grimaldo has to put it up, in and out. Would have been a great a confidence booster for Grimaldo had he made that. Nagana, Palma. The down low to Macaloni against Grimaldo. Macaloni, quick spin. No basket. The foul happened before the shot right there. You know, Sadaf, I hesitate to mention. I was, earlier, I was going to say, ang galing ng second unit na itong teams na to. But these two, these two groups playing right now, hindi sila mukhang second unit, eh, no? Talagang ganun sila ka star studded both teams. This timeout is brought to you by Embassy Whiskey. Chill Muna Tayo. Macaloni has played a key role here para sa run nitong Nueva Ecija Rice Vanguard. Season average niya, 10.7 points, but had 15 in that uh, Game 3 win against San Juan, a very important win that sent them to the National Finals. Oh, medyo talagang nahirapan sila bantayan ito si Will Macaloni. He just stood out like a sore thumb. Really great sore para sa kalaban nilang San Juan. Ball tapped away by Tabi. Ball will stay with Nueva Ecija. Three seconds in the shot clock. Much improved defense implemented by both teams. You know, they're, they're just going all out man to man and they switch every single time, making it tough to make an attempt. It's a big basket for Jonathan Oiloan. Fade away. Oh. Uh, Luna, shot clock was winding down. Here's Komia at Umatake. No good on the one-hander. Rebound, Renz Palma. Here's uh, Philip Manana. Taganas, Oiloan. Nakaloni against Grimaldo. Will, looking to carve space, travel. Good. Taking steps, great bump by Grimaldo. I love that matchup. Great defender, great offensive big man. Uh, Jason Marcelino returns to the ball game, getting a breather. A quick shout out to okay, uh, team owner ng Sambuanga Family's Brand Sardines, Mom Anita Kao, watching right now. Chairman Ernie Obando of Sambuanga City Water District as well. And of course, the Pampanga Giant Lantern team owner. Congressman Don Gonzalez as uh, Jason Grimaldo scores on that short stab. The one-hander, the famous one-hander. Sinabay na si Grimaldo at si Igilos. O si V. Oo nga, yung, yung, yung tandem ng big men na yan, matindi talaga, uh, you know, per, just 
protecting that paint. And you have those three short short guys of Sambuango who just go all out, but Valencia losing that ball. Oh! What a pass from Palma to Oiloan. You, you, you would think twice para umatake sa basket pag nandun si Grimaldo tsaka si Aguilos. Eh. Oo, oh, oh, mapapaisip ka talaga. But that time, Tabi caught napping. Kaya nakalibre si Uloan. Aguilos on the putback gets fouled. Mm-hmm. Some Buanga hanging in there. Let's watch this no-look pass. Lorenz Palma looking at Macaloni and passing the ball to Uloan. Oh, uh, Uloan making a great run, leaving his man. Nakita niya, iwan na iwan na kasi si Tabi eh. Ayun, oh, trailing sa kanya. Trying to sort things out. Well, never I see us, are, they're, they're huddled up talking and right now I don't understand why Samwanga don't get themselves together just to you know make use of that lull sa oras ng paglalaro we'll be right back as we uh, sort things out here in the venue seven and a half minutes remaining in the second period Coliseum in Palayan City and uh, fans of Nueva Ecija with uh, wearing some uh, Rice Vanguard's merch. Grabe nga, alam mo si Jeff, dumating ako dito, ang pila nila, isang kilometro yata, away. Taka, kumpul na kumpul, napaka-init. Could you imagine ang babango nila ngayon, ano, celebrating this game? Yeah, of course. No, this is the place <laughs> to be. Yes. And actually, Palayan City is celebrating its 57th founding anniversary in a few days. Yes, December this, 5. Oh, oh, huh. Five days yun celebration nila. Sinabi nga sa akin ng head ng tourism. Bakakusdaro namin natin pumunta. Eh, tinanong ko kasi kung kailan yung kainan. 
Babati lang ako. Uh, my former uh, barkada in Ateneo days, uh, Bopet Dizon kasama ni Governor Umali, isa sa mga kasama niya. No? Uh, so former barkada. So hindi mo na sa barkada? Because eh? um, many years away from each other. The last time I saw him, he was in Chicago also. Kasama niya yung roommate ko actually, si Blow Dizon, who is arriving. That's why he came up to me. Yeah, 19 to 16 ang ating score as uh, Jamo Aguilos is at the line. Coach Vic Ikasano. Ang galing din ng uh, pag-form ni Coach Vic and pagbuo ng team na to and you know working on that chemistry the whole season long. Totoo yun. It took time for people talaga to fall in love with this big man and understood bakit kinuha itong mga big man na to. And they proved themselves really well and that's the reason why they made it to the finals. These three, the tandem, plus Chito Hyman, who hasn't even played yet. Pero hindi natin nabanggit. Chris Bitton is in the ball game and loses it, as I mentioned his name. Oh. The foul on the drive from uh, Irvin Palencia. If you watch the previous game of Nueva Ecija, Chris Bitton just surprised me. Just, you know, nice to see him back in the way we were accustomed to seeing him play. Well, he was a 15 uh, to 18 point scorer with Manila. Yes. You know, uh, combining with Aris Dionisio during that time, they blitz Marcelino. He gives it up to Palencia. Eight seconds. In the shot clock, Palencia stepped on the line. Palita ng tao dito ulit. Finally. Bobby Balucanag, Pamboy Raimundo coming in for Nueva Ecija. What a luxury to have, ano? Bobby Balucanag, and pa pala. Hindi natin nababanggit. Ito naman, he plays big and small, but there you go, turnover almost. Recovered by Pamboy. Palma for three, no. Rebound to Michael Mabulak. Oh, what a matchup, Mabulak against Igilos. Bitorn. Steps back. The jumper is money for Chris Bitton. Oh, oh, two points for Chris. And look at Palma and Valencia right there. Nothing for that loose ball. Nakatawid ng Zamboanga. Here's JV Marcelino. Gives it up to JC. The shot clock was top. Well, our scoreboard actually gets hit by all the fans dun sa ating... Uh, sa area kung saan yung ano natin yung scoreboard natin natapakan ulit yata linya pa here we see that replay right in front of Governor Umali as well that oh. jumper from uh, Chris Pitoma maganda nga imbis na hinay five tinapakan niya yung paa eh. bago na ba yun uso ba yun oh, uso paa, paa it's it's just hard because of the sa sobrang dami ng tao dito ngayon uh, oh. Coach JV medyo hindi may iwasan no? may, may, may maapakan na nasaksakan yeah. and namamatay na lang yung scoreboard bigla and uh, that's just one of the challenges of this MPBL and uh, let's go to Mika Bisam this is Mike Mabulak's first stint in a full season MPBL finals and he said ibang pakiramdam dito Mika siya ang pinaka challenging para sa akin and it does not help na namamaga daw ang right knee niya at meron daw itong konting tubig pero finals na daw ito mamaya na daw siya magre-reklamo at alam nyo bang malapit na niya makuha ang kanyang 1,000 points dito sa MPBL he will be the 13th in the league and if ever 5th in uh, within the vanguards at alam mo sabi niya sa akin Mika i-announce mo sa mga fans ko pag nanalo kami dito sa finals sa kanila na itong sapatos ko balik sa inyo Coach JV Sedel Thank you so much Thank uh, you. Mika eh, kasha pa sa'yo yung sapatos kung ko, size 14 you know I've been actually looking we have a game on December 11 yan kung size 14 yan hihingin ko talaga sa kanya because I cannot find a size 14 pair of shoes oh you know as Mika mentioned he is 6 points away from 1,000, and the fifth player in the franchise. Can you imagine? 13, 12 pa lang for now, ah, uh -huh. ang nang umaabot ng 1,000 points dito sa MPBL. Wow. Pero apat nasa Nueva Ecija nasa, na team. Uh, ganun katindi itong lineup ng Nueva Ecija. Na bababanggit ko lang, yung ginagawa ni Michael Mabulak, uh, kailangan na iintindihan yung katawan nyo para magawa nyo yan. Yung tubig sa tuhod, oftentimes, 
ini-injectionan at kinukuha yung tubig. Dinedrain, dinedrain. Dinedrain yung tubig. But, and aside from that, not all players can continue playing having that. So, kailangan nga maintindihan mo yung body structure mo, yung pain tolerance mo, at yung desire ng puso mo para maglaro despite the pain. And he is a valuable player dito, Coach JV. Uh, just, uh, yung, yung presence niya. Uh, an inside force para sa Nueva Ecija. Both offense and defense. Oh, definitely. Napakaganda. Great that you pointed that out to them. That's Pero hindi na birthday. Hindi. Yung birthday mo, antay natin. Hindi na natin siya banggitin ang guest magpakain. Hindi <laughs> well, na naman na sapatos. Okay lang yun. Hindi, yung birthday boy sinasabi ko. Eh, tanungin mo rin, baka mamigay din na sapatos. Oo nga. That's the funny thing, no? I've asked uh, all around, I've asked help uh, from my friends where they can buy. Everybody told me may size 13 at may size 15. Size 14, wala talagang galit kayo. Ganun. So, uh, I think they've sorted out yung ating uh, scoreboard. 21 to 18 ang ating score. 6 minutes and 20 seconds remaining in the second quarter. Rimaldo, Iguilos, Marcelino, JC and JV, and Irvin Palencia. The five on the floor for uh, Zamboanga. Well, it's very evident sa Del. Iipitin talaga nila si JC Marcelino sa ibabaw pag sa tumanggap. He asked he should change his, uh, his desire to get that ball from the top. A great pass to Jay Moegilos. And Jay Moegilos making his presence felt here in the first half. Six points. As uh, Zamboanga is within one. Pamboy Remundo, Bobby Balocana, Chris Vitor, Michael Mabulak, and Renz Palma, the five on the floor for the Rice Vanguards. Here's Mabulak making his move. Nabitawa ni Balocana. And it's last touch on uh, Zamboanga. Merong limang segundo sa shot clock ng Nueva Ecija. Nakakatuan tignan, no? parang napakainit ang bola. Walang gusto ang bumuha. Michael Wico to inbound. Gives it up to Bitoy against uh, J.B. Marcelino. Balokanag, three-second violation. Well, the three-second violation was called because there was three seconds left, and Mike Mabulak expected somebody to shoot that ball. Our friends are uh, having a watch party right now. Javi Palanya oh. with uh, Gianna Llanes and Vince Tolentino. I don't know what's wow. In uh, sa place ni Gianna, nag-host ng uh, watch party si Gianna. Watch party. I've never attended a watch party. And dapat manood na at subukan mo. Um, ah, kala ko relo. Okay, sige, gets ko na. Manood okay. lang pala. Yo ko na. Alright, good evening to you guys. Enjoy the game. And then, uh, manunod din daw sila Coach Jonathan Banal and uh, his wife Anna and uh, Coach James dun sa mag magaling mag-host ito si Gianna oh, oh. mag-host ng uh, watch party ng watch and mag-host din oh. sana if I, did, if I host a watch party in Binyan you guys would all go and then, sa bahay na lang ako <laughs> pwede naman, may TV din naman kami or pwede naman sa cellphone na. pwede ka manood sa Facebook and uh, YouTube. Lopez coming out of the ball game. Yeah, he's Mike. hurt. Oh, mukhang na tuhod sa tuhod. So Adi Santos comes in. 14 seconds on the shot clock here. Japs Bautista also returning to the ball game. Here's Japs trying to spin away. Bito on. Caught. Reaching in. And pupunta sa linya si Japs Bautista. And in the cookie jars. Bago tumira, babatingin ko lang, nag-ayos ng kotse ko. Daniel Parikakay, uh, Francis Gonzaga, Ivan Padilla, Jomez de South, Kero Usman, Romero Ramirez. Good evening sa inyo. This retail is brought to you by Extreme Appliances, ang subok at kompleto appliance brand ng Pilipinas. Yun yung mga unlong car mechanics. Inayos kotse ko, kaya nakapunta ko rito. Eh. Kailangan batiin, hindi na nila ayusin. Si Japs kasi, bilis tumira eh, no? 
One for two for Chaps Bautista. We are tied at 21. I hate to say it, Sadel. 21 score tied. Papasok ng pagtapos ng halftime. Tagilid na tayo magsama ulit. Bitoon steps back for three. That doesn't drop. Agawan's a rebound picked up by Adi Santos. Marcelino quickly to Grimaldo. Keeps his footing under pressure from Balucanag. Smart heads up play by Grimaldo, choosing to bring that ball out. JB Marcelino, Grimaldo with a one hander. Wiko with a big rebound. Here comes Rabbi Sia. Piton to Wiko. Wiko nakawala. Didn't make a shot. Agawan Sabola picked up by. One of the coaches of Zambanga. Everybody actually on the bench was pointing their way. Nakikita mo, ang dami nating referee, ano? Talaga naman, kulang na lang, dagdagan ng pito dun sa sa bench na yun. Bawal ang pito. Ayun! Bawal ang pito dito sa... Bawal. <laughs> Maliban na sa referee natin. Uh, you know, what a crowd right here, Coach JV. I know, yep. I know you've been to some big games in the MPBL pero kakaiba din yung crowd dito eh. kakaiba at saka ano sila hindi sila bastos they are they're, it's a good crowd you know very nice to see a well mannered crowd there's Marcelino travel and you can just see the frustration of JC Marcelino they're not allowing him to play basketball tonight well Obviously, the scouting report all throughout the season is that uh, if you stop JC Marcelino, it's you get uh, probably half the job done against Sambuanga. Tama ka dun sa unang half, pero pagdating ng second half, this guy steps up. And time and time again, he's proven himself, you know. Maybe he didn't do well the first three quarters, but the most important thing is the last quarter. I've played against guys like that who I stopped the first three quarters and then on the fourth, ginawa ko asintahan. It must be traumatizing for you. Oh, yeah. Made me want to quit basketball several times. Buti na lang, announcer na ako ngayon. <laughs> well, I'll take this opportunity. I'm going to invite everybody. Pupunta kayo ng Baguio, December 11. Meron kami Legends game po doon. Uh, we will try to play, we will try to run, and we will try to shoot. Ang fast break dun talaga slow-mo na eh. And that's the only thing I can say about Legends games. Walang replay na slow-mo. Well, well never I see her. has been uh, teed up. You know, bench ng never I see her for a proper bench decorum. I wonder who. Yeah, but, the, but the thing is, parang ito kasi mga tawag na to. It, it come, come back to haunt you, no? Yung mga one point, one point lang yan. Pero Tama ka dun. Ang laking bagay nun. All adds up. And this was the play earlier. Travel on uh, J.B. Marcelino. Right there. Uh, that's where they were probably, you know, contesting the non-call. Oh, Raimundo caught on two minds. Marcelino quickly to Marcelino on that time. JB able to finish. What Four a points. relay pass. Great. Sorry, sorry, Sidaf. What a relay pass. Sorry. Alam mo, sa totoo lang, di kita marinig sa lakas ng mga sigawan dito. Biton. Ooh, hesitated a bit. Meron siyang uh, free lane dun. I'm glad you pointed that out. Yes, he did hesitate. Hesitate to the max. Clear path to the basket. Chris Bitton, a killer scorer. But in that situation, he stopped himself. Great relay pass there. Boom. The twins connecting once again. This time it was JC to JV. Here's Pamboy Raimundo. Here's JC Marcelino. Chris Bitton. Goes to Pamboy. Set. Second remaining the shot clock. Colliado with the offensive rebound. Goes down low to Mabulak against Grimaldo. Mabulak, tough shot. Rebound to Adi, Adi uh, Japs Bautista. Quickly to Adi Santos. And that's what they need to be aware of, Adi Santos, because he's the big man 
Right now, he can outrun, and he'll always run to the basket. Rabonga stretches the lead to five points. Mamboy trying to answer that short. Wiko with a rebound. Wiko forcing that one. Pero nakakuha siya ng foul. He'll get two free throws. Ikang kitikiting kilos. Ang hirap bantayan. This time, he was able to fish for a foul against J.C. Marcelino. Natin yung uh, pasa ni Jan Bautista to Adi Santos. And usually it's the other way around. Yung big man ang mabibigay sa, uh, ano, Kaso, sa guardia. Tama ako doon, pero second nature na ni Adi Santos. At alam niya, kayang-kaya niya tapuan si JC Collado. Collado, you know, he was there standing but just outran by uh, itong si Adi Santos. A miss at the line for uh, Mike Rico. 26 to 21. 0 for 2 for Mike Wico. Ang tapik na punta kay JC Marcelino. Notice. Has it got boys back in the game for Nueva Ecija? Oh, nga. notice how the big men of Sambuanga is controlling the boards. Grimaldo bothered by the D. Here's Bautista, puts the ball on the deck. Bautista, air ball on the layup. Rebound, Nicoliado. Quickly to Gabo. Oh! To Wico and. Wiko could not handle the pass from Gabo, just a bit ahead of him. I expected Michael Wiko to go airborne para saluhin niya sa ere and then finish off. Ali, Ali, you? Yeah. Pero he decided to try to bring that ball down to gather himself for a layup. Marcelino, Adi Santos with a jumper, offline. Gabo. Pushing the basketball. Hesed against Grimaldo. What a shot. From Hesse Gabo, four points. Marcelino on the crossover. Couldn't bank that one in, and ball goes back to Nevaisia. And then at the Dito, Hesse Gabo surveys the floor. But look at that, look at that layup, using the left hand. The momentum actually got that layup off. Oh, he hesitated a couple of times, went strong, bumped this man, and finished because of that momentum. Collado. Here's Renz Palma, eight to shoot for Nueva Ecija. Palma attacks, drops it off to Mabulak using the fake, and he puts it in. Michael Mabulak with eight points in the ball game. And that's experience. Oftentimes, you'd see a big man just hurriedly go up. Marcelino, oh, what a catch. <laughs> Grabe, no? Ayoko. Kahit hindi niya tinira eh, bilib pa rin Well, off balance na kasi siya. He wanted to get a higher percentage by just bringing that ball down. And at Inito, the drop pass from Palma. Couple of fakes from Abula. And he is uh, four points away. Mokosan. <laughs> Uh, couldn't shoot anymore. But this guy can sky. Actually, both brothers can sky. Tinde. Basta number 11. Malalakas talaga tumalun. Ano pang number mo? 11. <laughs> okay. <laughs> JC Marcelino. Tubong Olonga po. Six points, uh, three rebounds, and two assists in the ball game. Kambuanga with a three-point lead. Minute and 25 remaining here in the first half. Wow. Remember, I see a health to just 25 here. Starting first half. Averaging uh, almost 88 per ball game. Coliado Umatake, too strong. And there you see, the reason why they're being held down to that, that those, those many points is because nga, China challenge lahat ng tira. Ooh. Marcelino put on the line. Bola, mapupunta sa Nueva Ecija. Naninibago ngayon ang kilos ng, ng Nueva Ecija because of the intense defense by Sambuanga. Everybody's chasing each other around, challenging shots, forcing them to change their shots. Kaya percentage-wise, bumababa para sa Nueva Ecija. The ball wow. splitting the D and laying that one in to the delight of the Nueva Ecija faithful. Mukhang nawala defensa, binabanggit ko lang, intense defense, biglang sinuutan lang ni Ezed Gabo. 
Marcelino. Gets it to Lopez. Zamboanga has not made the three. Oh, great play. Oh, the extra pass. Wow. Decoy Lopez, smart play. Setting up Grimaldo. One setting up the other. Great execution here. First, Hesed Gabo. Ginamitan pa pala ng uh, ball fake doon sa drive na yun. Kita mo yung muso. And what about this play? Jas Bautista and Lopez before Grimaldo could have, could have stuffed that one in. Oh, what a, what a, what a three-man game they played in that execution on offense. Uh, 16,000 viewers on Facebook right now ang ating uh, MPBL National Finals and Abangan mo, dadami pa yan mamaya. Dadami pa nga. At good evening po sa inyong lahat. Good evening sa lahat mga nanonood from Zamboanga. Good evening sa lahat ng mga nanonood all around Nueva Ecija. Enjoy the ball game. Itong ating Game 1 ng MPBL Finals. Wow. Ang uh, dami talagang uh, nanonood sa atin. Kanina si uh, Mitch Gomez nanonood din. Ah, ah really? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, he was actually. Binati nga niya ako, ganda raw ng sapatos ko, buti pa siya. Ikaw, ayaw mo bati yung sapatos ko, ganda-ganda. Minsan lang ako nakahanap ng size 13. Well, Kanina, 14 pang base. Oh! Commissioner Kenneth Dorel, Head of Operations, Emer Oreta. Uh, Head of Security, uh, Rudy Distrito. And uh, Executive Officer, Joe Ramos, our MPBL leadership. They've, it's been a, a great season. No? Restarting yes. this this uh, MPBL na nag -full full blast ang season natin ang pagbabalik tama ka doon and uh, this time I'm gonna ask you a question Sedev ang tanong ko ay ganito ang tanong ko ay ganito this could probably be the best or one of the best finals or probably the best finals to be because yung matchups the quickness the youth everybody expecting after that COVID season everybody expecting MPBL back again that's true 13 seconds remaining. Here's Bitoon to Villarias. Balik kay Bitoon. Na-atake Nueva Ecija. But Zamboanga holding their oh. ground. But a foul on Comia on Villarias. But that was great defense the whole time. Yes. Everybody aggressive. Everybody switching. Everybody quick feet. Even big and small are switching. Uh, really... You're doing a fine job staying in front there. Everything but the landing. And that was a very tough shot for Villarias already. And for Zamboanga, if they don't play this way, they're going to get eaten alive. Gandang pag umpisa nitong ano, ha, ng Zamboanga dito sa game one natin. Villarias making his first. 3.9 seconds remaining. Two for two so far, para kay uh, Toto Villarias. Two for three. Grimaldo quickly to Comia. Comia fires Ooh. short. That will do it. I think first half, the kings of the south and the rulers of the north. Zamboanga and Nueva Ecija for the 2022 MPBL National Finals. JC Marcelino getting the early advantage against Michael Wico and the rest of uh, the Nueva Ecija Rice Vanguards. But count on coaches, Jerson Cabiltes and uh, Vika Casciano to devise ways for their teams to get ahead. Well, they did spend a lot of time watching TV, viewing of all their previous games, studying each other. Halftime tie dito, 30 to 29, Labangan Sambuaga against Rebbe Isaiah. Game one ng inyong MPBL National Finals.
Republic of Philippines Basketball League National Finals. My name is Mika Abisamis at nako mga kaliga, meron akong bagong kwento sa inyo. Ladies and gentlemen, the all-new Suzuki Avenis. Your muscular sporty scooter, it is one good looking scooter, reliable and value for money. At syempre, merong isang swerteng mag-uuwi ng isang Suzuki Avenis mula dito sa loob ng ating Coliseum. Basta sumali lang kayo dyan sa ating half-court shootout. And of course, this half-court shootout is brought to you by Suzuki. Oras na para mag-motor. At huwag natin patagalin pa. I turn it over to Richard Tampos for the shootout. Fans, we will be doing the half-court shootout courtesy of Suzuki Avenue's motorcycle. Nandito na yung ating mga participants. Ano ba, ladies first ba? Ladies first, talagang gentleman itong si Jacinto. Yes, your complete name. Rosalyn Joy Quezon. Joy na lang, Joy. Ichin niyo ako, hindi ko kayo bibigyan ng ticket. <laughs> Alright, palakpakan natin si Rosalyn Joy Quezon. Siya ang ating unang participant sa ating half-court shootout courtesy of Suzuki Avenue's motorcycle. Di ata agot. <laughs> Sige, punta ka na doon. Rosalyn, saan mo gusto? Dito daw, okay lang. Alright. Ah, dito lang. Yakang-yakang yan, Rosalyn. Galingan mo. Show your support kay Rosalyn. Palapakan naman natin. Nobo Isiano, ating first contestant sa ating half-court shootout. Galingan mo, Rosalyn, ha? You could win a brand new Suzuki Avenue's motorcycle. Pwede kang pumuelo, Rosalyn. Pwede kang pumuelo. Pwede. Ah, sige, sige. Yakang-yakang mo yan. Take it away, Rosalyn. Sige, focus lang. Lakasan mo. Baka makachamba. Brand new Suzuki Avenue's motorcycle. Eto na, Rosalyn. Yan, sinasabi ko sa'yo kanina pa eh. Bumuelo ka. Parang kulang sa palakpak. Di ginaganaan si Rosalyn. Come on, put your hands together. Come on, Rosalyn. Take it away. Here we go. Hey! Muntik na. Muntik na sa kalate, ha? <laughs> nice try, Rosalyn. All right. Next contestant natin, si Jacinto Gabriel. Asinto Gabriel, saan ka sa Nueva Ecija? Kabanatuan City po. Ayun, Kabanatuan City. Alright, bubuelo ka din ba? O oh, sige. Asinto Gabriel, galingan mo. You could win a brand new Suzuki Avenue's motorcycle. Eto na. Ay! Saktong sakto. Doon sa shot clock. Alright. All right, there you have it. Ang ating Suzuki Avenue's Motorcycle Half Court Shootout. Maraming salamat, Richard Tampos. At huwag kayo mag-alala dahil sa ating mga susunod na games ay baka manalo pa kayo niyang Suzuki Avenue's. And of course, this halftime court shootout is brought to you by Suzuki. Oras na para magmotor. And I would also like to introduce you to our new hashtags. Suzuki at MPBL 2022 Playoffs. Hashtag Win Suzuki at MPBL 2022 Playoffs. Hashtag Suzuki Motors PH. And hashtag Suzuki Avenis. At syempre, pagbalik natin, more action from Zamboanga and Nueva Ecija. Dito lang sa OK Bet Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League National Finals.
We are live from uh, Central Luzon and uh, in uh, the province of Nueva Ecija and for Game One ng inyong MPBL National Finals, 30 to 29 ang ating score, and it's been a, a festive in this uh, Palayan City. They're celebrating their uh, 57th founding anniversary on uh, December 5, but all roads uh, led to this uh, beautiful venue. Gapalita tong venue natin pero Grabe. Grabe yung atmosphere dito for Game 1 ng inyong MPBL National Final. At nabanggit mo nga yung roads. Grabe din ang road. The journey to Nueva Ecija. Where the, the, the detours we had to take because a truck uh, turned over. So, uh, ang tindi talaga. Just getting here added 30 minutes to our time, di ba? Ang tinding mga dinaanan nating uh, what do you call that? Rice fields and all that. But here we see at the game. Tulad ng game natin, the journey to this night. Amazing. Oh, definitely uh, a big start para sa, quick start para sa Zamboanga before Nueva Ecija found their bearings and eventually, itong uh, Zamboanga, their defense started to click in that second period and nahirapan ng gusto itong Nueva Ecija getting their baskets. They made to bleed for their baskets here sa ating uh, game one. Well, I like that you pointed it out. Sambuanga is playing tough defense, challenging every shot by every player. But Hesed Gabo showing me right now that I made a smooth mistake saying that because he just, you know, dissected that B. But here we see that great offensive play by the three men of Sambuanga. Mabanggit ko lang, dito naman sa Nueva Ecija, isa lang ang binabantayan talaga nila, JC Marcelino. Halftime stats natin sa Delft. Second chance opportunities, five apiece. Assist eight and nine, favoring the family sardines. Offensive rebounds, lima, very limited. Usually, double digits na by the halftime. Turnovers, 11 apiece. Converted lang ang Nueva Ecija, 13 to 10 sa kanilang pabor. Makikita natin, dikit na dikit ang laban natin, dikit na dikit ang mga stats. At pati yung upo natin yun, dikit na dikit. Yung hita mo, si Del, pakiusog naman. <laughs> Zero of six from beyond the arc at Zamboanga. And a one of nine naman at Nueva Ecija. So, you know, they, so both teams needing to come up with something special para talunin ang depensa ng kabilang team. Right, and they have. They really have. And, you know, it took a lot of TV time nga studying itong games na to. Bakita natin ang scoring leaders. Yeah, JC Marcelino and J. Moigilos with six apiece for Zamboanga Grimaldo and uh, J.B. Marcelino with four each para naman sa Nueva Ecija. Michael Mabulak leading all scores with eight. Hesed Gabo has six. Toto Villarreal with five, and Jonathan Oiloan with four. Mabula is four points away from uh, the 1,000 point club. Jamo Igilos, he's been big in that first half, and na biglasya ng ano ng na focus eh. Pero alam mo naman yung mga kaya. Alam mo kung ako na focus hindi ako tatawa. Hindi ka tatawa. Hindi ako smile. Bakit hindi ka smile? Game face. Game face. Game face. Yeah, game face. This is the finals. Yung focus dapat, hindi nawawala. Ako, I take every opportunity pag naka-focus sa akin, pagtatawa talaga ako. We start the third quarter with uh, Nueva Ecija. Uh, the possession has said Gabo. Oh! Uh, Ating uh, scoreboard. Beatin tayo dun. Ano mamaya? Yan ang ayoko kasi sa technology natin ngayon. Nung panahon ko kasi, chok lang eh at blackboard. Tapos yung stopwatch. Stopwatch lang. Na, inibin, na, Yan. Na pinipin na sa gitna. Never nagkaroon ng technical difficulty. Nauubusan ng chok. Yun ang nangyayari. Napuputol. Aside from that, they should actually consider that next game. Okay na. Okay, okay na. na. 30-29 30 to, to ang ating score. Hesed Gabo. Colliado. No hesitation from Villarreal. Nueva Ecija retakes the lead, 32 to 30. Oh! And uh, Villarreal comes up with a defensive gem on the other end. Great anticipation on the move of JV. Blocking the path, getting that charge off of JV. Colliado able to find uh, Villarreal. Marching orders is to get the shooters going for uh, Nueva Ecija. Well, kailangan. Isa yan sa mga tools kung baka sila nananalo outside sn sniping. That opens up the defense allowing the big men of Nueva Ecija allowing the big men of Nueva Ecija to score. 
Getting physical, Sadel. Let's get physical. Okay na. Oh, uh, yun lang yun. Two. Alam mo sino kumanta nun? Quick team fouls. Ma mamaya, sabi mo. All right. Nine and a half minutes left. And uh, may dalawang team foul na kagat ang uh, Nueva Ecija. 32 to 30. Has set. Spins. The turnaround shot. Couldn't make the basket. Rebound to JV Marcelino. Quickly to JC. Dumapig asking for it. Against Colliado. Dumapig. The kick out to Decoy Lopez. Lopez trying to uh, find his way inside. JV Marcelino recovers the loose ball and draws the foul. JC Marcelino, no, that time JV Marcelino just never stops. The two brothers find a way to get that ball and score. Loose ball. Uh, habuli talaga. Uh, magkapatid yung ball. <laughs> oh, oh, and that's the reason why playing against Sambuanga, I don't think you should call it a loose ball. It's game ball for them every time. Yung, yung, yung nose for the ball nila, no? Ibang klase talaga. They, they'll, they'll go after every loose ball. And, uh, you know, I can't count how many recovered possessions they've had this season para sa team na to. Kasi nilalagay nila sa puso nila that they continuously move even if they're not the one shooting because any loose ball is an opportunity to get that ball back. Napagandang ugali nila ng dalawa. Michael Wico. Never I see ahead. 32 to 31. Gabo inside to Colliado. Nice find. Ang Hesse Gabo to Colliado. Meron ng apat na putos. Well, J. Colliado set that pick great and got the mismatch. Forcing Japs Bautista to recover to his man, leaving himself alone. Bautista pulls the trigger. Too strong. Gabo with a rebound. Quickly to Wiko. Wiko trying to attack. Stops and finds Villarias inside. Toto Villarias coming alive in the third quarter. Five points for Villarias. Oh, here we see that great pass inside to Jay Colliado. Doon, biglang nawala ang, ang bantay niya because tumulong si Japs Bautista recovered back to his man. Great pass by Mike Wico. No look. Villarias moving without the ball. Was asking for a foul right there. He's got five of his ten here in the third. And yan ang po ang namang ng Nerva Ecija. We have a timeout. Myron Villarias uh, was uh, on fire against the San Juan. 19 points on 6 of 10. Three-point shooting. He averages 38% for the season. And uh, really deadly for uh, Nueva Ecija. Deadly sniping from the outside by Byron Villarias, plus the tough defense. Oh, look at Crystal Mopping. Picked the ball out of the air and putting it back in. Four points for the Mopping. And Zamboanga cuts the lead to three. Nang mama, eh, no? Talagang ginamit niya mga braso niya to get himself in a position to shoot. Colliado fires. Nope. Rebound. Cyrus Tabi. Quickly to JC Marcelino. Marcelino looking for his twin brother. JC gets it back. Oh. Foul away from the ball. Dumapig and uh, Colliado. Actually, teammates uh, with uh, Basilan in our past uh, regular season. 
Oo oh, nga, kaya yun, medyo na-miss nila ang isa't isa, kaya nagparamdam. You know, these two teams are highly matched, and that's why for me, if I give them a title, it, this, this series is gonna be a fight for one. The fight for one point, because that's all it takes to win, and both teams are fighting for just that one extra point to win this series. Uh, we, we've seen a championship series go down the wire. No? One point as uh, JB Marcelino misses on the jumper rebound and Michael Mabula. Harassing B, great tap by Tabi. Mm -hmm. 18 seconds to shoot for nearby Sierra. They go to Macaloni against Lopez. Big Will trying to force his way inside. Will Macaloni, a bull strong lefty. And immediately, Coach Big brings in Jason Grimaldo to match up with Will Macaloni. And look at how. Macaloni just eats up the space from uh, Decoy Lopez and uh, the basket. Well, he's got wide shoulders plus the wingspan gets around his man. But, you know, Jason Grimaldo back into the ball game equally lengthy. And talagang yung banggaan itong dalawang to magandang tignan ang outcome. The five points for Will Macaloni, 39 to 33. Nueva Ecija. With a six-point lead. Here's JC Marcelino. Now with Grimaldo. Back to JC. JC attacks. And a foul. On that drive from JC Marcelino. He's just so quick. Upon receiving the handoff, Dinadiretso na. Well, the mindset niya talaga is to score. And if he hesitates, that's not the JC Marcelino we're accustomed to. And that's what you do. Look for space to score. Bring yourself closer to the basket. But he needs that running start. If you prevent him from making that running start, he'll be forced to take a jumper, which the percentages go down. The referees discussing the call. Just a regular foul on Will Macaloni. Yun, tinulak niya si Dumapig. Si Dumapig, um, nabanggat kay uh, Marcelino. Yes, I've done that so many times in my career. Bump my teammate ha, kasi tinulak ako. Ikaw, tinignan mo ako agad. Hindi ako nanunulak sa Duff. So no free throws there for JC Marcelino. Here he is. He goes left. And just putting pressure on the D there, JC Marcelino. He has to. He should actually sacrifice his body, add more tape. He's got his, both knees are taped up. He's got everything, his right shoulder is taped up. Tape everything up right next, now. Next foul will be uh, free throws para sa Zamboanga. Just the first team foul for Michael, uh, first foul on Michael Mabula. Here's Marcelino. And what a move, JC Marcelino. And he gets the end one. Looked like a swan dive, extending. With his left, then the dive. Yeah, you want to see a Michael Wico there. Terrific move from JC Marcelino. Dalawang uh, dribble lang yun. Ang hirap nun because when he takes off, he elevates so high plus he extends his arm towards the defender. Kaya nakasungkit pa ng foul. Meron ng nine points si uh, JC Marcelino. Lead is, lead is at three points for Nervai Sia. Nakatawid na si Hesed Gabo. Gabo, extra pass. Too strong on the shot from Will Macaloni. Zamboanga back the other way. Dumapig lays it in for two. Yan yung tipong napaganda pa. JC Marcelino dropping that ball on the lap of Dumapig. There's Macaloni, just to bumawi. Rebound nakuha ni JV Marcelino. Takbo ang Zamboanga. JV. Gets it to Grimaldo. Libre si Grimaldo. Gives it back to JV Marcelino. There's a foul away from the ball. Well, Will Macaloni pulling back Dumapig. That would mean free throws 
for Chris Dumapik. Alam mo, para lang maintindihan ng mga viewers natin, tumatakbo ang Sambuanga because when they run fast, nagkakaroon ng mismatch because whoever is the first to guard the runner, whether big or small, whoever adjusts later on, hindi na tao talaga nila ang nakukuha. So mismatch happens when you run fast on the offense. Streeter is brought to you by Xia Appliances, ang subok at kompletong appliance brand ng Pilipinas. I don't mind Dumapig missing that shot. You'd want it to go in, but because he bangs a lot, nakakapagod ang banggaan sa loob. Tapos titira ka pa. Kita mo, hingal na hingal, oh. A one for two for Chris Dumapig, and we are tied at 39. Kanina, anim yung lamang. Ngayon, nakabawi na. Well, never talaga lalaki lamang nito. Basta tayo nagsama sa laro, si Del. And I feel bad for Mika that she has to join this event with us. <laughs> has said Gabo for three. No. Nope. Mabula. Oh! And a foul on Dumapik. Sabuanga surprised with the call as uh, Dumapik was boxing out Michael Mabula. Tinamodito, you be the judge, Coach JV. Dumapig actually was just preventing Mike Mabulak, but because the ball bounced towards Mike Mabulak, he had no choice, but suddenly became an offensive threat. Kaya, ayun, nung inusog na siya, kumapit bigla itong si Dumapig. If the ball actually bounced further away, that would have probably been a non-call. Michael Mabulak, three points away from... Uh the 1,000 uh, point club. Uh, violation. So ball goes to uh, Zamboanga. Chance to take the lead here for uh, Zamboanga family, family's brand sardines. Pinasok na si Jemo Igilos, kapalit ni Chris Dumapig. So Grimaldo and Igilos, the tandem that has really anchored this Zamboanga defense is back on the floor for Coach Vicky Kashan. Oh, 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 itong big men ito. Sila talaga nagbigay ng sakit ng ulo protecting the paint for Zamboanga. JC Marcelino. Marcelino attacks. No. Grimaldo with the offensive rebound. Gets it to Tabi. Open three. Pasokan para kay Cyrus Tabi. Tabi has been consistent. What a game for him. Several games. Once he's free and takes that shot, he makes it. Zamboanga on top, 42 to 40. First three of the ball game for uh, Zamboanga. Mabula. No. Rebound, Jamo Igilos. Just one opportunity for Nueva Ecija. No second chances there. Great defense again by Zamboanga. Marcelino. Oh. Taken away by Bitoon. Running the break. Villarreal for three. Pasakyan! <laughs> 13 points for Byron Villarreal. Just as he has done all season long. Well, don't palang release and end the spin on the ball. Oh, look you can at see hard there on Komia hung in the air momentarily. Galing din niya Komia makakuha ng contact. Well, because yeah, he becomes a threat, and right now Uto sa defense ng Nueva Ecija is challenging everything. But here you see the release, the setup, and the spin on the ball. Alam na alam mo. Yeah, the three-point shot is the game. Is brought to you by Shim One-Stop Shop Appliances. Uh, Toto Villarreal. What a pickup for Nueva Ecija. He played for uh, Bataan in uh, the earlier se seasons and MPBL. Also made an impact there. Left Komia at the line. Oh. In and out on the first. Yeah, makikita natin one point lead ng Nueva Ecija. Sabi ko nga sa'yo sa Delpe, fight for one. This game is a fight for one. Puta muna tayo kay Mika Abisantos. 
Just to add to your stories, it's Byron Villarez's first stint in the MPBL National Finals. He was humble when he said, "Matindi tong kalaban namin, Mika, even with our lead." Or uh, and also he said, "We still need to control their full court defense and fast breaks." Now we also know what this guy can bring on the court, right? Well, I just found out that he has an aunt who played in the volleyball Philippine national team, and of course, his cousin Bong Ravena. Oh, de ba si Del Coach JB? Wow. Oh, all right. Well, he comes from a, a very uh, a family of athletes as well. You remember Vic and Vernie Villarreal? Of course. How can I forget the two UE brothers? Talagang pinahirapan nila kami nung panahon namin in college. Egilos attacks. No, gets it back. Binigay kay Grimaldo, no good. Agawan with Shaq Taganas. Taganas wins the battle. Recovered by Bitoon. Looked like a volleyball game. Bitoon to Macaloni. Nine points for Will Macaloni. Neva is here with a four point lead. Three and a half minutes remaining in the third. Irvin Palencia finds Comia, fires, no, Iguilas with the rebound, Jamo rises and puts it in. Simple basketball, put back for Jamo Iguilas. Paganas gets it to Villarias, Macaloni, a running start, the kick out to Biton, Biton finds Manalang, Thought about it. Manalang blocked by Grimaldo. Takbo Zamboanga. Gomia loses his balance. Tabi dives in vain. And ball goes back to Nueva Ecija. I don't know what Gomia was trying to do. Really didn't need to. Yeah, I could have given that ball up. But he tried to slide through the defenders. And look at Grimaldo. Talk about protecting the rim. Ah, mukhang nadadapa na siya. He yeah. actually tripped. Ayun, so, sa bagay, may mga na situation talaga. Biglang kakapit ang paa mo sa sahig. Forces you to trip. Oh, man, kahit wala nang buhay na trip <laughs> Oo oh, nga. Sa edad kong to. Actually, tripping right now, I enjoy doing because it makes me sit on the floor for a couple of minutes. Bitoon. Oy, loan. Fires. Yes! Sir. Both teams exchanging big baskets here in the third. Bautista attacks. Bautista gets the bounce. Not intimidated by the crowd's presence. Four points for Japs Bautista. Inside to Eloan. To Macaloni. And then see Igilos. Macaloni just put it up. And the putback is good. Relentless effort by Will Macaloni. 11 points for Will Macaloni. Nerva Isia up by five. Grimaldo. Vinigeke Marcelino. There's the double team. Grimaldo trying to find Igilos inside. That was telegraph. Adi Santos coming in for Jason Grimaldo. Well, Macaloni getting a much deserved breather. It's been a tough evening trying to find baskets inside, especially with Grimaldo and uh, Igilos there. Well, maganda nga matchup ng mga big men dito. Talagang banggaan sila. And they, they, they're actually equally strong. Valencia misses on the jumper. Igilos. Gets stripped by Manalang and Palencia fouls Bitoon. Great hands by Manalang, anticipating that grip on the ball of uh, Aguilos. You know, our game has been so tight. Uh, so tight. One point, two points, ganyan. Lumamang ka lang ng lima, medyo matataranta ka na because it's something that you don't want the opposing team to have, a five-point lead. Never I see a lead is up to six. It's actually the biggest lead of Never I see in this ball game. Right now, six yeah, points. Yeah, six yes. points. And no team has led by more than six. And uh, Bitoon makes it a seven-point lead for the Rice Vanguards. 
John Mahari comes in for Irvin Palencia. 54 to 47. There's the count. Minute and 26 remaining. And the third, Ginasa Parensi Renz Palma in place of Philip Manalang. Mahari, JC Marcelino, Igilos, Adi Santos, and Jas Bautista, the five on the floor for Zamboanga. JC against Bitton gets fouled and he will go to the line, JC Marcelino. Well, anyway, you can get the point. It's great for Sambuanga. You know, on other situations when you play other teams, you get the star player into foul trouble. That helps you out. In this team against Nueva Ecija, hindi rin makakatulong. Those guys from coming off the bench are equally great. Muntis ang unang free throw from uh, JC Marcelino. Second one goes down. And Palma able to save that basketball. Here's Chris Bitton. Finds Taganas against Santos. Back out to Bitton. Bitton, stop and pop. No. Nope. Rebound, Adi Santos. There's Marcelino. Against Renz Palma. They go down low to Jas Bautista. Against Piton. Igilos. Baseline J. No. That's last touch on John Mahari. Well, Jamo Igilos took a shot from the corner. Something he, he really has a perimeter shot. It just hasn't been as often as you'd like to see him do it. 54 to 48. Free throw shooting. Sambuanga has missed eight of their 19 free throws. If I see anyone, six of 12 at the line. Really bad shooting for a finals. Mabula. Six seconds left in the shot clock. Mabula. Eleven points for Michael Mabula, and Nueva Ecija has an eight-point lead. JC Marcelino lost the handle. Mabula trying to chase it down. And Jan nagtatapos ang ating third quarter. And what a quarter para sa Nueva Ecija. Myron Villarias and Will Macaloni joining forces to give Nueva Ecija some separation here in the third. 13 points for Villarias on three of six shooting from beyond the arc. Macaloni delivering the goods inside. 11 points for Will Macaloni. Dominance inside, great shooting outside. What a combination. Very tough to defend a team when they're scoring in and out. 27 point explosion in the third. Para sa Nueva Ecija, and they are on top, 56 to 48, with one quarter remaining in game one.
Back inside the Nueva Ecija Coliseum in Palayan City. It's the start of the fourth quarter. Then game one, ng, uh, MPBL National Finals, Zamboanga against Nueva Ecija. Zamboanga down by eight as they begin the fourth period. JV Marcelino, Andy Santos, uh, Josh Bautista, JC Marcelino, Jamo Iguilos, the five on the floor for Coach Vic Ecashano. JV misses the three, rebound to Jamo Iguilos. Against Renz Palma. Jamo gets it to JC Marcelino. And we didn't have time to discuss the quarter scoring. Basta, ang cuento sa third quarter, 27 to 18. And uh, Jan po, yun po yung difference kanina. Oh, nga, hindi natin nabanggit sa tindi ng action ng ating umpisa ang fourth quarter. Chris Bitoon, uh, Shaq Taganas, Renz Palma as Bitoon misses. Sama na si Mike Mabulak and uh, Jonathan Oiloan. Oh, what a pass right there para kay JV Marcelino. So, four quick points here for Zamboanga and it's just a four-point game. At dun sa situation na yun, na naka-easy basket ang Sambuanga, makikita natin sa replay mamaya, yung ginawa ni Adi Santos, very smart, helping his teammate get an easy basket by screening off a second defender. Mamaya, hopefully makikita natin yan sa replay natin on that layup. Noel Macaloni returns to the ball game. He's got 11 points. Bitoon gets it to Oiloan. Jonathan Oiloan, binigay kay Macaloni, short on the layup. And Jamo Iguilos with another rebound. Oh, nga, intimidating presence there. Medyo na off balance si Will Macaloni. Marcelino to Iguilos, using the left hand, he gets blocked. Adi Santos inside, wala pa rin. Takbo never I see, huh? Play broken up, pero naka Chris Bitoon ang bola. Oh. Trying to find Renz Palma out of control there. And the Chris Bitoon expecting Renz Palma to be in the paint. Oh, nga. The first thing you do is come close towards the basket because Chris Bitoon was attracting the attention. Ito makikita natin. Chris Bitoon. What a move. And that's uh, the play earlier. Yun, yung pasa kay uh, J.B. Marcelino. Pero hindi nakita yung ginawa ni Adi Santos. Japs Bautista. That's Japs Bautista. Finally hitting the three. Here's Mabulak. Basket and one. And he is the newest member of our 1,000-point club. And well, Mike Kabulak had everybody beat, and I don't know why they had to foul him. You know, sometimes you just had to let it go because an extra point is not something you can easily give up. Lalo na pagdikita ng laban at malakas ang kalaban. The 13th player in league history, Michael Mabulak, to reach the milestone. And the sad thing for Zamboanga, walang bumaba pagkatapos ng three points ni uh, Jazz Bautista. But uh, nonetheless, Congratulations, para kay, uh, are in order to uh, Michael Mabula. And he gets a ceremonial ball from uh, Commissioner Kenneth De Remdes. Loud wife there. He should keep that ball. Yeah, he should. But they're going to use it again. I'm going to protest. <laughs> Kunin mo, saka ibigay mo ulit sa kanya. Baka hindi na ibalik sa kanya yun eh. Or bilhan mo na lang siya ng bago kung gusto mo. Bibilhan ko siya ng bago, sige. Just the presence of mind though. Para, you know, off a made basket. Para makakuha ka ng uh, fast break layup na usahan mahirap ngayon makashoot ah, uh -huh. sa depensa ng dalawang team. Pero medyo nakakalungkot din ano, when making that achievement. JD Marcelino, too strong. Agawan sa rebound, ends up with Villarias. Agawan sa rebound, Grimaldo and uh, JC Marcelino. Wiko, trying to spin. Nice fake, couldn't get the roll. Macaloni, another try, wala. JD Marcelino. Umatake si JV. Layup doesn't work. 
And rebound ni Michael Wico. Ano sinabi mo? Bakit nakakalungkot? Nakakalungkot because he did a thousand points. Now he has to go for another thousand. Back to one na naman siya. Parang <laughs> how sad naman, ano? Hindi. Kailangan na yung magtrabaho pag... <laughs> Trabaho pa. Another five years in the league. Come on. Kaya mo yan, Michael Mabula. Wow. Villarias from way out. Adi Santos collects the rebound. Oh, Zamboanga. Back in the thick of the fight after that uh, big run by Nueva Ecija in the third. Marcelino inside, short on the left. Well, you can see the fatigue factor affecting both Marcelino brothers. Stepped on the line. Look at the D played by uh, Grimaldo Jason Grimaldo. There. Moving, using his feet to play defense at hindi lang nanulak. And the way Zamboanga has set out para ma-counter to mga strengths din ng, uh, ng Nueva Ecija is also very impressive here, Coach JB. Impressive talaga. It's a human chess match. Makikita natin, imbes na nakikita natin malilit na kahoy na piraso, makikita natin buhay na buhay ang mga ginagamit ng mga coaches to try to win this game. Well, the old Gerson Cabiltes, of course, the record speaks for itself. Rebounding story, Sambuanga able to get the advantage. And that's the reason why they're still in this ball game. Oh! There's a foul. And it looks like it will go against Macaloni. It's very rare, ah. Huh? Yung team uh, nakalaban na Nueva Ecija, they get out-rebounded. Oh, oh, naman. And kaya nga, before this game started, the coaching staff of Nueva Ecija, they were telling me, they know that they match up well, yung big men. It's not really gonna be a, that much of a factor because they cancel each other out. It's the small guys, how they contribute and how they play with their big men. Mabulak returns to the game. Uh, balik sa bench, Will Macaloni. Tabi gets it to JV Marcelino. JV, umatake. And nakakuha siya ng foul. Uh, two free throws si J.B. Marcelino after that drive. The way he extended on his arm, alam mo, not really to score, but just to fish for a foul. This time rewarded. You know, hirap talaga ang dumipensa ng ganyang players sa Delft. Lalo na pag nag -e elevate They finish way up in the air, but they miss again. Free throws brought to you by Extreme Appliances. Ang subok at kompletong appliance brand. Ng Pilipinas. Yun nga tanong ko, binaba, binabanggit mo, brought to you by, hindi eh, pumasok eh. Okay lang daw. Okay lang yun. Okay lang. All right. Eight points for JV Marcelino. It's a two-point game. Six minutes remaining in game one of your MPBL National Finals. Live from uh, Palayan City, Nueva Ecija. Hesed Gabo. No good on the three. JV Marcelino quickly to Tabi. Cyrus Tabi leaves it to Dumapig, and he ties the game at 58. What a run. Nine points by Dumapig. Complimenting lang big men, capable of running, outrunning Mabulak and Collado. 10-2 run to start the fourth quarter. Cyrus Tabi to a trailing Chris Dumapig for the two points as uh, Sambuanga has clawed their way back into this ball game. 58 all. We had five minutes and 47 seconds remaining. Timeout, Nueva Ecija. outside the Nueva Ecija Coliseum in Palayan City. Si ba pati si Baby nanonood, Coach JV. Oo nga, talaga naman, kita mo, batang-bata pa, pinapakita. Oh, paglaki mo, anak, ganyan ka ha, maging player ka. 
23,000 on Facebook and uh, 13, uh, almost 14,000 on our YouTube pay, uh, channel as well. So, and of course, One Sports Plus. Grabe lang yung uh, suporta ng taong bayan sa MPBL, sa Liga ng Bawat Pilipino. Hindi pa binilang yung mga tao sa labas. Yun nga, eh, marami ah, din yun. Marami rin yun. Oo, so, uh, it, you know, from, a, from the bottom of our hearts, I know it's very late into the season, but uh, you're still there. Nasuporta nyo pa rin ang Liga. Hesed Gabo! What a getaway! Hesed Gabo! Eight points in the ball game and Nueva Ecija regains the lead, 60 to 58. Umahanap lang talaga ng butas. He did that earlier sa first half. Again, just dissecting itong defense ng Nueva Ecija. Go Mapig getting inside position on Jake Oliado. 11 points for Chris Do Mapig. Do Mapig sanay sanay mak sanay na sanay makipagbanggaan talaga. Banggaan and playing basketball. Wiko trying to find his way through. There's a foul. And it looks like it will go against uh, Chaps Bautista. Bring you this uh, epic move of the game in partnership with OK Bet. Own the win. Hesed Gabo. Just keeping his dribble, probing and probing, and uh, finding his way through to the basket. Eight points, three rebounds, and three assists. Para sa starting point guard ng Nueva Ecija. Pero I share that point kay Michael Mabulak for setting a great pick. Wiko couldn't finish. And Mabulak is fouled inside. Well, we need to point out to the nagkakaroon na naman ng second, third chance opportunities ang, ang Nueva Ecija. Nawala lang si Jaymo Aguilos. JV Marcelino is replaced by Cyrus Tabi, who's uh, been terrific in this ball game. I sense Tabi's gonna hit another three. Speaking of a three, that's Byron Villarreal. On cue, 16 points. And Reba Isia is back on top, 63 to 60. Four and a half minutes remaining in the ball game. Here's Tabi. Gets it to Grimaldo. Nag-alangan. Binigay kay Tabi. Gustong bumawi ng tres. Wala. Dumapig inside. Lost the handle. And it's last touch on Chris Dumapig according to a referee. Well, the referee who should have called it was the referee standing on the right side. No call was made. Instead, the referee under would naturally call the ball favoring Nueva Ecija. J.V. Marcelino back in the game in place of Cyrus Tabi. Here's Gabo. Bothered by the Dio Grimaldo. Oh. That's a push on J.C. Marcelino. Well, J.C. Marcelino had good intentions, but he just ran over at si Hesed Gabo. The ball back at the line. At dito natin makikita, uh, Sambuanga has been missing their free throws. Crucial free throws, titignan natin kung si Hesed Gabo may papasok niya para sa team niya. Uh, Hesed Gabo has been uh, through some uh, very uh, uh, tough moments for Nerva is here and he has delivered Coach JV. Ang laro niya ngayon para siyang the worm. He would just slither through that defense. Totally opposite of, of course, the real worm, Dennis Rodman. Two for two for Hesed Gabo. Five point lead for uh, Riva Isia. Marcelino gets it to Dumapik. JV gets away and puts it in. JV Marcelino found space inside. And 
Marcelino with the finish. Free throw woes, yun lang talaga ang namupino problema ng Zamboanga. This time, JV makes it. Completes the three point play. It's a two point lead for Nueva Ecea. 65 to 63. JV Marcelino, 11 points, six rebounds, and three assists in the ballgame. Coliado to Gabo. Gabo, the reverse! Yes, yeah, said Gabo. Coming to life here, J.C. Marcelino. Oh, J.C. Marcelino. just do a sham god. <laughs> oh, my. He was actually forcing the issue. Marcelino. Oh. That's the rebound. Here's the mopping. Two on one break. A hard foul. By Colgado. And Chris the mopping. Well, J.C. Colgado just stood his ground. Took on the freight train. Head on. That's a big object right there. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> a foreign object running into. See, Dumapik, alam ko malakas din ang katawan nito, pero. <laughs> yeah, but you see JC Collado, he really leaned towards the defender, the, the, uh, uh, against Dumapik. That's why he had stopped the momentum. Just a regular foul. Just making sure na. It's a playoff foul. Sabi ni Michael Mabuok, Satchan daw nagkatalo. Satchan nagkatalo. Well, the birthday boy making a sudden stop on the freight train. 67 to 63. Again, just to bo boil down to the free throw situation natin. Sambuanga has missed a lot, very badly needed. And he makes his first, Chris Demopic. What a game for him. Fourteen of twenty-three free throws para sa Sambuanga. They missed nine. Sanay na sanay. Yang mga ganyan sitwasyon sa Duff, I've been through that. You don't hear anybody yelling. Basta focus ka sa iyong gagawing pagtira. It's a two-point game here. Villarreal fires again. Pasok yan! Well, one of the Marcelino brothers has left him again alone. They're automatic. Ito si Toto Villarreal and... What a time for him to hit those shots. At talagang ano, hanap hanapin niya yun. Great anticipation. Oh! Macaloni inside. Short stab. On. No good. And dagawan sa bola. Dumapig and Mabulak refusing to let go. And there's a technical foul. Niyakap ni Das Bautista si Mabulak. And the crowd getting into it. Chris Dumapik has actually played well in this ballgame, Coach JV. Yes, he has. I mean, a physical presence sa loob. Very tiring style of play. And here we see the wrestling match. Ayo bitawan ng isa't isa. I don't think there's... I don't know why. Something there. Wala, wala, shouldn't be a technical there. No technical da, but yun, this is something that they really need to look at and just... Hopefully they reverse the call. No technical given there. They, it's just all out hustle and total respect because no elbows were thrown. Yeah. It's just, you know, nice basketball. And that, that's what you want from the two teams. Tama ka dun. And we have to compliment that. Ito mga referees, I hope they turn that. I, I hope they, you know, just let that thing go. When you play with passion, when you play with pride, jan lumalabas. Oh. 
pag hindi nila maisip to, toss coin. Kaninong bola, toss coin. Pwede ba yun? Toss coin. Di yata. Ano? No. Yeah, Titinan natin <laughs> kung anong uh, verdict dito ng ating reference. I do hope that they acknowledge it. Yes. Playing hard. Maybe a warning. The worst case scenario. But, you know, nothing really bad, I feel. All ball. It was all ball. Just physical play. It's a, it's a jump ball. So no T. Hopefully no T. Two minutes and 25 seconds remaining. And uh, what a game. Especially the second half, Coach The second half started tough penalty. for both. It's a you know, they, they just went all out at it. But the breaks of the game favored Nueva Ecija. A lot of forced attempts and missed free throws para sa Sambuanga. And that's the reason why they're trailing by five. So the two... There's, there's a call for taunting. Taunting. Mm -hmm. And... Well... So Chris Domapig at the line made his first two earlier. He's been solid in this ball game. And I like the way he's focused on, you know, the confidence he has despite the yelling crowd and the jeers. And wow, you rarely see that from a player who's been banging all night. And that's a tiring job, said Del. He's played his heart out, Chris Domapik. Two for two at the line. Four straight baskets, six points for him. 15 points. 15, 15 points. points, I'm sorry. I was actually looking who's guarding Villarias right now, and he should be shackled. 70 to uh, 67. Has said Gabo, finds Mabula. And a foul given up by JC Marcelino on a driving Michael Mabula. That's a good hard foul. No easy baskets. Been there, done that. Especially at this point yes, of no, the ball game. No easy basket. All the points come from the line. Yun nga, sa, until makarinig ko sa'yo, tama ka. It's a fight for one. Fight for one point. And that's why no easy baskets. Of course, hindi kasama dun sa sinasabi ko si Villarias because this guy, every three-pointer is an easy basket. And Michael Mabulak, too strong on the first. Actually shot it to the right. Oh, well, that turns out to be a good foul for J for Jamo. Oh, sorry, Jason Grimaldo. JC Marcelino. <laughs> foul, yung foul? Uh, oh. oh, I thought it was Grimaldo. Seriously? Yeah, one for oh. two. And uh, Nueva Ecija up by four. The pressure here is the backcourt. JV Marcelino magbababa ng bola for Zamboanga. Binapatay ni Villarias. Here's Grimaldo. Down low, they go to Dumapig, taken away. This last two minutes is brought to you by Embassy Whiskey. Chill, muna tayo. Dumapig wasn't set. The pass came. Hasn't established his position. Turnover. Gabo. Matched up against Dumapig. Gabo. What a move. Unable to finish. Save by Mabulak. Villarias quickly to Wiko. Eight seconds in the shot clock. They go to Macaloni against Grimaldo. Macaloni, the fadeaway. Foul on Mabulak. And that will mean that two free throws. And a technical, I believe. For Chris Dumapi. Oh, no. I thought the, the referee made that the sign push. <laughs> He's fouled out of the ball game, Michael Mabula. 14 points, 5 rebounds. What a great game for him. And 5 fouls. Yeah, but actually, itong uh, playoffs, madalas na pa foul out ito si Michael Mabula. But, uh, well, Rebais, he has, has survived some of those ball games na kung saan na foul out siya. Chris, Mike, Mike Bulak, yeah, talagang, he, he will get into those 
situations kasi nandun nga siya eh tulakan oh. too strong on the first one short on the free throw to uh, Chris Domapik what a turnaround for uh, Nueva Ecija they've actually scored 42 points in the second half after scoring just 29 in the first. Well, Hesed Gabo penetrating, Will Macaloni posting, and Villarias just scoring from the three. Whoa. Long rebound goes to Gabo. Fouled by Marcelino. And that will mean two free throws for Hesed Gabo. Pang-apat na na foul ni J.C. Marcelino. And, uh, J.R. Taganas returns to the ball game. Two timeouts each para sa ating uh, dalawang kupunan. Oh, very, very good thing to have, especially down the wire. Uh, 12 points, 5 rebounds, 6 assists para kay uh, Hesed Gabo. He's come out strong here in the fourth quarter very fresh Chris Beton came off the bench and really did a great job backing him up oh quality minutes for Chris Beton but Hesed Gabo he was actually the one who just dismantled the defense interior defense and some bonga 14 puntos para kay Hesed Gabo and he extends the lead back to 6 73 to 67 Minute and 22 remaining. Zamboanga asking for a timeout. This timeout is brought to you by Embassy Whiskey. Chill, Munatayo. PBL National Final Schedule, December 2, Monday, ang, 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 uh, December 2 po ang Game 1, ngayon po yan. December 5 and Game 2 on Monday, back here in uh, Nueva Ecija. And Game 3 on Friday, that will be in Zamboanga. Game 4, uh, if necessary, is scheduled December 12 and December 16 ng ating Game 5, if ever. If ever, tama ka doon. Ako, masasabi ko lang si Dev sa nakikita kong paglalaro ng dalawang team hindi abot ng 7 games to hindi naman talaga abot eh ano tama ako five lang, eh? so tama nga ako okay inbound for uh, Zamboanga here's JC Marcelino block ball will stay with uh, Zamboanga with 7 seconds in the shot clock look at the defense here by Michael Wico that is off Shaq Taganas. Wiko actually, kung may makakatapat sa Marcelino Brothers, isa sa doon because he's equally fast and he can actually leap and has long arms to defend the shot. Marcelino gets a running start, picked up by Igilos. Dumapig inside, forced that one. Great defense. And the shot clock will expire. Violation, turnover for Zamboanga. And they come up empty on that possession. Minute and eight, 68 seconds remaining. Well, in, the, well, in the last two possessions, is lang talaga ang outside shooter nila, si Japs Bautista. But he's being hounded. So no other attempt from the outside. And they're forced to penetrate and you know try to score in the painted area. Very tough to do when you've got the solid defense now implemented by uh, Nueva Ecija. Well, they expect you know, see, uh, no, to Zamboanga to drive hard to the basket because there's no outside shooting. Outside shooter, oh. 
and a lot of them actually you can shoot from are, are, are sitting in the bench. Tavi hit one. And, 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 you know, Rico in trouble here. He gets it to Poliado. Now with Gabo. JV Marcelino nakabatay and natawid. She has it, Gabo. Great job, Porter backing here in the fourth quarter. Yes, said Gabo. Not on their feet. Gabo for three. Yes, sir. Off the glass and in. Yes, said Gabo. Sealing the deal for Nueva Ecea. 17 points. Para kay Hesed Gabo. What a great game for Hesed Gabo. This guy just, you know, took over. He had to do things that, you know, Sambuanga definitely could not prepare for. And that's just dissecting the defense at will. And what a performance from Hesse Gabo, especially sa ating uh, fourth quarter. Big game once again for Hesse Gabo. As he scores 13 here in the fourth quarter to help seal the deal. Meron pang uh, 46.9 seconds remaining. But uh, Zamboanga down by nine. Oh, what a game though. It was tight all throughout, uh, Coach JV, until the Hesed Gabo came, came through in the clutch. Oh, nga, talagang broke, his, broke their box. And plus the clutch shooting of um, Toto Villarias. Uh, maganda na ang depensa sa kanya, naka-extenda yung kamay, pero still, he makes those, like, I don't know, I don't know y what you say. Yung, yung, uh, yung mga tirang yun, hindi lang yung three points eh. May dagdag pa na sakit sa mana ng loob yes, sa kalaban kasi ganda din ng depensa eh. Ganda ng depensa rin. And you know, the backbreaker nga talaga. But the execution of this play, laking bagay ito because still, you'll be facing Nueva Vaisiya again. So you really need this execution to do to run well. Sa atin na miss ni Japs Bautista. And Japs Bautista down on the floor. Nueva Vaisiya will get possession. And uh, Nueva Ecija still in command. 37.9 seconds remaining. And uh, Coach JV, uh, some of your takeaways here sa, sa performance na Nueva Ecija ngayon. Well, it looks like they're on their way to taking a one to nothing lead in the series. Well, if I predicted before the game and I wrote down three things as a prediction of what I would see tonight, I'd, I would not guess that the great performance of both teams would occur on this game one. You know, everything just was based on the situation they see on the court, and they reacted greatly at on Nueva Ecija. Same goes for Samboanga because they just fought hard. And Bautista, 6-3. to three. Wow. And the turnover... It looks like they'll check kung uh, nakaapak sa linya si Jabs Bautista. But nonetheless, a glimmer of hope. No, may fake pa yan eh. Oh, he yeah. still stu stepped on the line. Yeah. Just a two-point basket. Sayang, ano? Those are the things you need to be aware of. Just to, you know, make sure you get the three points. But you, ne you can never tell. 18 points down a minute and plus, nagawa namin nun. Record yata yun sa PBA. And so, with 31 seconds and 7 points. Well, both teams over the limit. They have one timeout each remaining. Pero alam mo naman, ang situation ng Nueva Ecija, they made a mistake earlier. They're not gonna make yeah. the same mistake Absolutely. again. Yeah. 76 to 69. 14 seconds. So even sabi ba kadi pa bola sa Sambuanga. They get the ball to Gabo. JV Marcelino nakabantay and he gives up the foul on Hesed Gabo. Nice 
sa inyo po. Yung nga yung sinasabi natin, he came in in the fourth, fresh, fresh. well rested, yeah. and just took charge. Yep. And I'm about to stand to go get my shoes from Michael Mabula. Hindi pa. Kailangan mag-champion mo na. Alright. With all, you know, probably all the VIPs in this province here in the venue. And Rabbi Sia comes up with a sterling second half performance. Lopez sinks the three ball. Lead is at six points. Gabo will hold on to the basketball and uh, it will get fouled by JV Marcelino. That's 15 points in the fourth quarter for Hesed Gabo. Well, Sumbuanga's playing with all heart. They're still, you know, not letting this go. They're not just going to end the game, allowing Nueva Sia to just run the time but, off. But, you know, if, if you're Coach Vicky Kashan, what, what were the positives that you saw here, Coach JV? Well, they actually lost this game because of, one, free throws. They missed a lot. Uh, two is the miscues. They had uh, several guys get them, getting themselves free unchallenged for easy baskets. And that's the only thing. Um, other than that, everything went well for oh. But here we see another three. Mahirap magsalita ng tapos. Another foul there. So Hesse Gabo back at the line. 20 points for Gabo. JV Marcelino has found out of the ball game. Japs Bautista hitting the three. The lead is at four points, so just still a two possession game. As JV Marcelino fouls out with 11.6 rebounds and three assists. So, uh, said Gabo. Have to give uh, Mirvais here more separation here. He does. It's 21 points for Hesse Gabo. This is actually a break for the next game, you know. Yun lang naman yun, and that's the reason why Sambuanga is not stopping. They, they, they're continuing to yeah. you know, pressure this Nueva Ecija team. Yeah, really setting the tone for the next game. Tabi to Bautista. No? And that will do it. Nueva Ecija. Pulls off an 81 to 75 win in game one of the FPBL National Finals over a hard fighting Sambuanga Family's Brand Sardines. It's a big win to start the series. Holding serve were the Rice Vanguards holding home court. Lito Saneva Sia, and they'll be back here again on Monday going for a 2 to nothing lead. What a great game from both teams. There we see Hesed Gabo just penetrating at will. And that's not just one time. He did that several times all throughout. 22.6 rebounds, 6 assists, 9 of 10 free throws. Yeah, big free throws coming in the final quarter para kay Hesed Gabo to hold off this Sambuanga team. And 18 points in that final quarter. A big game para kay Hesed Gabo. And as we mentioned, Toto Villarreal. Uh, Will Macaloni, Michael Mabulak, they all played well. Yes. Especially Toto Villarreal. We could have given uh, him the best player of the game. Right. Kung hindi, um, you know, when, before Hesed Gabo came up with those big plays down the stretch. Oh, nga, laking bagay talaga ng contribution ni Hesed Gabo. Because, you know, Sambuango's doing such a great job. Yun nga lang, pumutok itong si Hesed Gabo. Let's go to Mika Abisames, who is with the best player of the game. Maraming salamat. Kasama ko nga ngayon ang best player of this ball game na si Hesed Gabo. You know, Hesed, we all saw that Zamboanga gave you guys a really good game here in your home court. Ano, kahit nung dulo ng mga final seconds, but your performance stood out, especially when they needed you the most. Uh, we were just reminded to uh, uh, to just keep on uh, uh, playing defense because defense wins championships. So that was always a reminder. What do you want to tell everybody here today who's supporting you and if you want to thank anybody? Uh, 
first of all, syempre, uh, I want to thank God for giving us the win. Uh, uh, I want to thank all the Novoisianos na pumunta dito sa venue. Uh, ramdam na ramdam namin yung pagmamahal nyo sa amin. At uh, nagpapasalamat ako, syempre, kila Boss Bong. My kids. Ma Boss Bong, Cuevas, uh, uh, Mayor... Uh, Uh, Vian Cuevas, Boss Ivan Cuevas, Ma'am Rian Cuevas. At uh, inuulit ko sa walang suporta ng mga sa walang sawang suporta ng mga Novo Isiano. Maraming 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 salamat po uh, kay Boss Raymond Garcia of Power Hoops Pinas. Syempre sa family ko, uh, sa baby ko kay Stella, uh, kay Ina, kay Boss Enel. Uh, All right, thank you very much. Let's give him a breather. This player of the game is brought to you by OK Bet. The official part of the MPBL with OK Bet on the win. Balik sa inyo, si Delph, Coach JV. Galing-galing ni Hesed Gabo uh, for this ball game, And he finishes uh, off uh, the Zamboanga family's brand sardines to give Nevesia a one to nothing lead. He was our best player of the game. Brought to you by OK Bet, the official partner of the MPBL with OK Bet on the win. So, uh, one to nothing for Nevesia as they get the head start in the series against Zamboanga. But we will be back right here on Monday night para sa Game 2 ng inyong MPBL National Finals. For my partner, JV Gayos, our courtside reporter, Mika Bisamis, and for all the men and women uh, working here in the MPBL, of course, our hosts, Nueva Ecija. Maraming salamat po sa inyong pagsuporta at pagsubaybay sa Liga ng Bawat Pilipino. This